So, thank you very much. So, so before before all this craziness happened in Australia, you, you are a well-known soap opera star. I did. I did a uh, soap opera called Home and Away back in Australia. Yeah, about three and a half years. For three and a half years. What, what are yeah. some of the things that you've gone through in three and a half years? Uh, just the, the normal mundane stuff. I was uh, in a bushfire, a helicopter crash, a plane crash, a mudslide, uh, had a drug problem, then became the sports psychiatrist after. <laughs> had about six different kids to several different women. Um, <laughs> Yeah, and my character was 17 for about three years. So, uh, so you did all that at 17? Yeah, yeah. I want to declare you an honorary did. Latino. <laughs> there you go. All that. Uh, Welcome to the club. Thank you. Just the usual soap opera, uh, opera life. You know, was, uh, <laughs> now, when you came to the United States, was it hard to, to connect, get work right away? Yeah, I mean, I, I had a few months um, where I was busy, and then, and, then, and I wasn't busy, and I started running out of money, and... Uh, my manager uh, let me live in the guest house of him and his family. And uh, so that meant in between auditioning, I was uh, babysitting their kids. And, uh, and it was just quite an interesting, interesting period. I remember shooting Star Trek and, and coming off the, off the bridge of the, the Enterprise and thinking, you know, I've made it, this is it. And then uh, dirty nappies welcome me at home and, and kids running around that I had to look after. You're changing them. diapers and yeah. you go <laughs> It was a <laughs> nice sort of transition, yeah. It's an amazing success story because in, in, in this year, You've gotten married, mm -hmm. right? Congratulated, yeah. got married. Thank you. <laughs> and, and you got a hit movie and you're Thor. How about that, Chris? That's, That's exciting, man. That's great. That's Very good. exciting. Thank you. Yeah. yeah who, who, did you, who did you marry? What, what is her name? It's uh, Elsa Pataki. She's a Spanish woman. Yeah. From Madrid. So, so. From, so, yeah. Yeah. Wait a minute. So, so you married a Latina? I did, yeah. 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 <laughs> and she's an actor. She's in, in Fast and Furious. She is, yeah. Do you speak Spanish at all? Uh, un poquito. Poquito. <laughs> poquito. I bought I bought Rosetta Stone actually, and um, and learnt things like uh, los niños comen, el niño bebe, like individual statements, which random. I don't know where. Say I'm the second one again. This lady went crazy. Uh, <laughs> what was it? El niño bebe. <laughs> And what does that mean, exactly? I think the, the kid drinks. The kid drinks. That was it. Like the, the boy drinks. runs, the girl drinks. It wasn't very yeah. non-specific. Let me tell you, I, I want you to learn Spanish faster than Rosetta Stone. Okay. So I'm going to get you a year bus pass to drive around L.A. Oh, that's good. <laughs> that, that Is that you'll, the key? You'll learn like that. Good, I should, I should. You'll learn, you'll learn helpful phrases like, Por favor, no me maten. <laughs> Please don't kill me. Sure, okay. Aquí, un café con leche, por favor. Ca café con leche. <laughs> All right, so we have a clip from Thor. I yeah. love the I saw the movie, by the way. I love it. Oh, thank you. I love it, thank and you. you're fantastic in it. Thank you. Okay, so set this clip up, Chris. Okay, so uh, Thor is the god of thunder, and uh, he, he's from another world, and he's been banished to Earth in, uh, in a mortal form, and um, he's been tasered, so he's unconscious, and then taken to the hospital where he wakes up and, and doesn't really appreciate being, uh, being touched. Take a look at this, from Thor. Hi. Just taking a little blood. How dare you attack the son of Odin! I need some help! I'm trying to help you. Ah. Oh, oh, security! Security, the ER3! Ah. 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 for the mighty. So, when I saw Thor, I, I looked at you and I said, that is the biggest dude that I've ever seen that can act. <laughs> you know, because you're brilliant in the movie and Thank you're you. tremendously, I mean, you're much bigger th th in the movie than you are now, right? Yeah, yeah. I um, read the comic books and, and noticed the guy was rather large, so I had to get in the gym and yeah. eat, force feed myself uh, chickens. Here's a, here's, here's, a picture, here's a picture of Chris in costume. Check this out. Look at that. Now, when I Idris was here, he said the costumes were heavy and they were uncomfortable and that you had to be screwed in. We did. It was a good hour process in the morning of uh, 
chest plate, back plate, shoulders, arms, cape, the whole deal. And uh, they didn't breathe at all. It was incredibly restrictive and incredibly hot. Uh, and it was, uh, I'd spent six months kind of training, trying to put the weight off, uh, put the weight on, and then would be sweating it off in a day or two. So um, we actually, they invented this sort of, uh, this cooling suit, which was a vest we put on underneath, which had a, a rubber tubes run up through it, and we'd plug it into like, cold water, and it would, it would try and cool you down. And, so underneath the uniform, you have like a water shirt? Yeah, yeah, because you take the thing off, and, and you literally, you'd be all wrinkly, and like you'd been sitting in the bath for four hours. Yeah. It's, it was disgusting. Yeah. And, 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 there's, and there's no notice of that in the, in the movie at all. When you're acting, there's not one thing where you're like, no, you know, <laughs> it's probably yeah a little bit of twitching well, occasionally. Even when you took it off, it was so hot that you steamed. You did, yeah, yeah. The the, the temperature difference would cause a bit of uh, steam to rise off your body. Wow! Well, <laughs> well, congratulations. Let me tell you, Thor is is the god of thunder, and and you work well with a hammer. Your 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 power is your hammer. Yeah. Okay, so so being Latino, my people have also been very successful with hammers. Sure. All right. <laughs> so I got a, I got I us got a couple, couple of hammers. Good. And, I want, I want to challenge Thor, the god of thunder, to see if he can beat me in a game. You ready, Chris? Come sure. on over here. <laughs> a game of whack-a-mole, all whack right? Whack-a-mole. But let's make this, let's get this Thor, let's get this thing. Let's get suited up, yeah? Safety gear first. That's always a, a good start. <laughs> all right? Okay. Have you played this game before, Chris? We have like whack the kangaroo or something. Okay, <laughs> all right. a, a bit different. <laughs> all right, that's good. Whoever whacks the most moles in 25 seconds is that right? Wins. Are uh, you ready? Let's do Are this. you ready, my lord? I am. I am. My my king. Here we go. Is that started? That's it. Everybody will be right back.